Hi, my name's Hayat Rachi. I'm the owner and founder of Neon Moon Lingerie, empowering women in all phases of womanhood. Like the phases of a moon, it changes shape throughout the month, but always remains the same celestial being. I like to think that women are similar. We can fluctuate in shape and size of our breasts and bums, but always remain the same person. I always wondered, if lingerie didn't have the sexualized connotation from the moment we're given our first bra, would it help girls pursue more in life? Not everything is about looking sexy or being objectified for the male gaze, and that's why Neon Moon was created. So with the help of the charity The Prince's Trust, I started putting my idea into action. I was accepted onto their year-long enterprise program and the real work began. I was assigned my mentor with who I have monthly meetings with and I attend monthly seminars on a range of subjects by professionals in their field and also I get priceless words of encouragement over the phone, all for free. Listening to girls was how I based Neon Moon's first capsule collection and overwhelming support came from inadvertent feminists giving me the confidence to create Neon Moon to encompass exactly those values that I wish I had when I was growing up. There is a very narrow standard of beauty in today's society and Neon Moon is set on changing the lingerie industry for the better. It doesn't matter whether a girl has hair, cellulite, stretch marks, scars, acne or freckles, a Neon Moon girl embraces her body. We see ourselves in our lingerie every day before getting dressed or undressed. It's only right we show our bodies unaltered and realistic to what we all see. Bamboo fabric has been deliberately used so a girl's body creates the shape of the garment and not the other way around. It is also naturally antibacterial, extremely soft and beneficial to the allergy sensitive girl. It is also considered a fantastic sustainable resource. In a world where young women are bombarded daily with over-sexualized imagery, Neon Moon girls strive to be successful in their own way and their own right. Through Neon Moon, I aim to perpetuate empowerment to girls who might otherwise feel pressurized to look a certain way. Hello, I'm Snow Key from Taiwan. I'm a makeup artist and I'm a Neon Moon girl. I'm Michelle, I'm a videographer. Um, I'm also studying commercial photography at the Arts University of Bournemouth, currently in my third year. And I am a new um, girl. My name is Victoria. I'm a photographer. I'm currently studying in LCF year two. And I'm a new girl. This is Paulina. I have a master's in translation, Spanish translation, and I'm working as a freelance translator and part time model. I'm half Polish and I am a neon moon. Hi, my name is Adabre Ibiyama. I am from Boston, Massachusetts, living in the United States. And I'm an actress and also a event producer. I'm producing an um, art event for International Women's Day, and I am a neon moon girl. My name's Hea. Um, when I was young, I was always on free school meals. I'm Moroccan. I was born to immigrant parents. Uh, at the age of 10, I won a scholarship to play the clarinet. Um, at sixth form, I actually failed a year. And uh, once I had my A-levels, I went on to university. I was the first person in my family to, and to graduate with first with honors in economics. Um, I also have like an incredible knack for getting fired. Um, so yeah, I'm you know I'm proud of all my successes, all my failures. I I own it all, and I'm proud to also call myself a Neon Moon girl. Supporting Neon Moon's Kickstarter campaign is one step towards creating a society where the over-sexualization and objectification of girls in the lingerie industry is no longer acceptable. I would love you all to join Neon Moon's community, whether you're a father, mother, daughter or son. If you agree with the vision and want to see change, you too are a Neon Moon girl.